I was, you know, at a table. I was trying to get some last minute homework done. Alina Ta was at San Jose State's Student Union Wednesday evening studying when she says a man came up to her and asked her a bunch of questions that made her feel uncomfortable. But I try to tell him, please try to find another student, try to find someone else. He wouldn't stop bothering me. He left, then came back again and insisted on talking with her some more. Alina says she went to the bowling alley downstairs and hid. After that, I wasn't able to pay attention to whatever happened during class. Um, and then 30 minutes after, I just spent it panicking. So San Jose State is equipped with these blue light phones that allow people on campus to call police if they have an issue. But where Alina was in the student union, she says there weren't any nearby. University police actually got several calls that day about the same man. They say he's not affiliated with the university. They were able to determine that the, the uh, suspect or the individual was undergoing a mental health crisis. Captain Frank Belcastro says officers connected this man with help. He notes the university is an open campus, so anyone has access to spots like the student union. But certainly if there's criminal behavior or someone's acting in a manner that endangers our population, we need to know about it. I think one of the greatest parts about San Jose State is that it is public. Alina says she hopes this incident sparks a campus wide conversation about helping students like her feel safe while also being thoughtful to community members who pass through. In San Jose, Alyssa Gord, NBC Bay Area News.